What's up, y'all? Just a quick little side topic, topic, man. Just, just a side discussion, man. Uh, I noticed that you guys aren't hip hop heads, man. Whenever I mention hip hop, you guys are like, ah, yeah, hip hop. Ah, he's talking about hip hop. Yeah, like it's just killing you. <laughs> but uh, man, let me say this, man. For someone, it got me to thinking. For someone who's never listened to hip hop, not interested in hip hop, who would I recommend that they check out? Uh, if they were interested in giving it a try, like I, I'm giving metal a try, who would I start them off with, man? <laughs> and it came to my mind, man, I would start that person off with Dr. Dre. I would start them off as, as a foundation of where to start off with hip hop. I would start them off with, with Dr. Dre, the family tree of Dr. Dre and his career. All right. So once you start with Dr. Dre, that's going to give you your NWAs, right? And then that's going to branch off into uh, Ice Cube. And then that's going to branch you off into Snoop Dogg. And then that's going to branch you off into Tupac when he did All Eyes on Me. Uh, and you see where I'm going with this? This is all from Dr. Dre. The NWAs, the Snoop Dogs, the All Eyes on Me's, the 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 Ice Cubes, it, 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 and you just keep going from there. Dr. Dre, it's gonna give you Eminem, it's gonna give you Fifty Cents, it's gonna give you even the the side crew, uh, the Nate Dogs and the Warren G's, it's gonna give you um, uh, even some the Brats, you know, who 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 kind of picked up the G Funk style from Snoop. Uh, it's gonna give you. Uh, the game it's it, it's gonna give you some features that he did with Kendrick Lamar you see how it all is the, the base is coming from Dr. Dre you see where I'm going with this man so that's where I would start from someone who's who's not into hip-hop that's who I would recommend start from Dr. Dre and branch off from that family tree and his career and all the things that and all the work that he's done and that will give you the foundation of hip-hop right there man and that's who i would recommend man uh also if you guys would ask me who was my my number one personal hip-hop artist of all times i would say kanye west because i'm more into art and not necessarily words and lyrics you guys probably notice i haven't been listening to too many words i, I just like theatrics man i think i like how you say something i like things that transition into something and go somewhere and that's what kanye west gives me man he gives me more than just you know bars and lyrics and and you know blah 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 and all that stuff man he gives me like uh uh, uh art and that's why kanye west is my number one artist because he gives me art go check out um the my beautiful dark twisted fantasy movie and you see what I'm talking about, man, how Kanye West is so much more than just rapping. And uh, I would, ooh, I would love to see somebody uh, do a Kanye West marathon. Yes, yes. Somebody who's not into hip hop, please take the time out and do a Kanye West marathon. I would love to see your reaction to it. I would love to see you shit on it if you don't like it. I would love to love it if you love it. I just want to see somebody react to my favorite hip-hop artists like i've done to some of y'all favorite metal artists you know i might have shitted on it i might have loved it but uh I, I guess it was entertaining and i would love to see somebody entertain me by doing a kanye west marathon that would make my year y'all go ahead and do that for you boy man all right i hope you guys enjoyed these little side conversations and we'll you know do a little more of this stuff like this man all right out